Good morning, Leo. How are we? I hope all is well with you. Let's get you a reading. If you are new here, welcome. If you are returning, I'm very grateful to have you here. Let's see. Let's take a look at what you need to be aware of at this time. Please be reminded this may or may not resonate. Flip the rolls as you see fit. I could be picking up on your energy. I could be picking up on the energy of someone around you. Let's take a look. Ah, oh, why? The cards want to speak. Justice is in the reverse. Eight of Wands is in the reverse. Okay, let's see something. Let's see something here. What does Leo need to be aware of? Let's go straight in, Leo. Tell me about Leo. Messages for Leo, please. Strictly Tarot. The Queen of Coins. We have the Chariot and the star in the reverse um be careful of what you invest in at this time it could be like a with the nine of wands yeah you may be moving towards something some sort of contract this could be about your work or something that you want to get involved with the five of swords in the reverse that maybe you shouldn't get involved with um there may be something that doesn't give what it needs to give leo or you could be disappointed it, it's like the energy of being excited about something, moving on it, moving forward with it, and then realizing that it isn't a wish fulfillment after all. This could even be a relationship investing in a, a person. This could be a Cancer, an Earth sign, Aquarius. What's the star in the reverse? Actually, no. Queen of Pentacles, Queen of, Pentacles, Queen of Coins first. temperance in the reverse the ace of wands don't be don't don't get caught up on the fantasy of something um you may be very attracted to something something may look very shiny leo something someone or something may look the part they may even dress the part you may be very attracted to whatever this is or this person but with the temperance in the reverse this is not a dynamic that is sent by the divine you know that energy of um if it's not sent by god i don't want it <laughs> this may be that type of energy what i'm picking up on the temperance is in the reverse this is not something that you really should be mixing in and um, you may be running the risk of getting involved with something, being very um, taken by the passion of something. This could be, you know, you're only thinking with your loins. You may do something impulsive because something looks good. It looks the part. I keep getting that. It looks the part, but it really isn't. And you're definitely moving towards this thing, chariot, the ten of wands. Yeah. Yeah. You could be definitely putting in a lot of energy and time into something that is going to be a flop. So be careful. Some of you, this could be already, you've already done this. This could be in relation to a fire sign. Five of swords in the reverse. Yeah. There's a warning here, Leo. Two of wands in the reverse. Don't, yeah, about a decision. Judgment in the reverse. It will be a poor choice, yeah. With the ten of cups. This could be investing in a home or a family situation. The Six of Swords in the reverse and the Eight of Wands. Um, with the Five of Cups. Leo, listen. Ten of Coins. It could be about money. This could be about a family dynamic. You could be wanting to start a family with somebody. For some of you, if you are a masculine energy and you deal with fem feminine energies, this could be about a person. This could be about somebody who looks like they have it all together, but there's something off about this person that you probably don't see. Maybe you're seeing what you, you want to see. This is, a, this is advice, Leo. You're seeing what you want to see or you're being very taken by the, the fantasy of it. You know, they look the part. They even dress the part. They talk the part even. They look like they may have a lot of abundance. But this is something that you're going to be signing up to. That with the star in the reverse you will regret. And a lot of you are going to be trying to put in a lot of effort with this. But I, I do sense an energy here Leo. Of you 
definitely being the one that's holding up more of the responsibility or you you're going to be signing up to a burden or signing up to something that you you're going to struggle to get out of this thing whatever this is and this is kind of what this person wants i'm really edging towards a person now the two of wands you may be making a decision or you're about to make a decision on something or someone that you feel like is a wish fulfillment but it really isn't with the five of swords in the reverse this is something that you need to avoid. And if you don't avoid it, you will regret the choice. There's something here about a decision being a poor one. And with the Ten of Cups, it may be about settling down with somebody that you shouldn't be. This may be choosing somebody who you shouldn't be choosing, but you feel like it's a good choice. Or this could be something that you did in the past. The Six of Swords is in the reverse. Again, there's an energy of it not being sent by the divine. The divine is not leading you to this. This is something that is not sent by the divine. So where is it sent from? A lower entity? <coughs> the eight of wands and the five of cups. Whatever it is that you're moving towards is going to end in a disappointment. I'm really sorry to say that. And with the ten of coins... You may want to invest big on something. There's something that you're really fired up to put the energy into. Ace of Swords, King of Wands. You're very attracted to whatever this is or whoever this is with the Empress in the reverse. Uh-uh. This is somebody who could be a user. This could be somebody who's very entitled. This could also be some sort of distorted feminine. I'm getting a masculine energy right now. You could be a masculine Leo. You don't have to be. You could just be a feminine who is um, very stable. Um, you could be a feminine who's embodying more um, fiery energy at this time. You are a Leo. Um, or you're embodying more of a masculine, fiery sort of vibe about you. You know, you see something, you're excited about that thing. You want it, you go for it type of energy. A very go-getter type of energy. Um, King of Wands, you're very fired up and excited about this person that you're, you're, you're looking at potentially to getting involved with. But with the Empress in the reverse, there's something about you not being treated fairly or you're going to end up realising that whatever this is, you have not been led by the divine with this decision. This is a decision that you're making out of um, physicality. This is a decision that you're making out of um, possibly a, a sexual desire. This could be a decision that you are making out of ego. Because someone looks the part. Someone talks the part. Someone has a lot. Someone's abundant. Or they seem like they are abundant. Sometimes abundance can be fake. Some of the most richest, more, most established people are the most plain dressed, dressed down people who drive the, the least expensive car on the market. Do you know what I mean? It is not a measure of somebody's credit score or their wealth. Don't be taken by outside appearances. We live in a very 3D, superficial world where people see that people have things and they assume that there's wealth behind it. That is not always the case. It's usually those people who flaunt their wealth, who, um, you know, do all of that. It's more likely that those people don't have their affairs in order, okay? Mm -hmm than people who are more modest, people who just drive what they drive. They may have a nice car, they may, you know, have a few nice things, but then they don't feel the need to parade it about. They don't feel the need to, you know, do all of that flash in the cash business, you know, flinging the dollars at the, the, the camera as you see all the rappers doing, you know, flaunting the wealth. It's usually those people who are the most low vibrational a lot of the time, it goes to their head okay so be careful of not getting taken getting taken into that because of it looks it looks appealing it looks shiny it looks nice it looks whatever and i do feel like i'm talking to a masculine king of wands is here there's an energy here of you you in, investing indulging in something because it strokes your ego because it looks good it looks the part and i feel like it's a masculine Empresses in the reverse comes out. Whoever you're dealing with, three of coins. Yeah, you're going to get proposition to work with somebody here, Leo, or this could be something that's already happened. But with the, with the Empress in the reverse, this is somebody who is not in the best energy. Not in the best energy. One second, Leo. Not at all. Empress in the reverse. 
I don't get this um, Empress, the Empress in the reverse very often. Let's get you. A little bit of context. Let's see, let's see. This could be somebody who's very overbearing, insecure. Um, this could be somebody who's negligent, somebody who is neglectful, okay? Smothering. This is somebody who possibly um, lacks growth. Um, and lacks progress and somebody who could be wanting to rely on you for all of that rather than bringing that to the table so be very careful be very careful with that person smothering controlling unable to express feelings um low self-worth yeah be careful with this person you're gonna get a love offer i do feel like this is a feminine energy you're gonna get propositioned and the queen of swords in the reverse somebody could be very very um calculating manipulative this is not a good combination the Empress in the reverse, the Queen of Swords, and you're going to be working with this person or getting propositioned to potentially have a um, collaboration with somebody. I just feel like you're being propositioned or you were by somebody who didn't have the best intention. This is somebody who is very, very manipulative. This is somebody who will have an ulterior motive as to why you you should work with them the eight of swords is in the reverse and the world card for some of you you're removing yourself from a person that is like this with the three of swords yeah and this person is going to be heartbroken that you are not choosing to work with them with the emperor in the upright i feel like you are a masculine leo or you're just about your business i'm getting a very masculine energy even if you are a feminine there's a masculine energy about you a fiery energy you could have a lot of fire placements in your chart in general um you are definitely about your business you're solid and somebody sees you coming and press in the reverse i feel like it's it's a masculine who needs to protect himself from a feminine the empress in the reverse and i feel like you're either going to catch on to this or you need to be catching on to this to end this with this person or to not go ahead the eight of swords is in the reverse you need to not get stuck or wheeled into this dynamic with this person with the ace of cups this might be something of a love-like nature which is what i'm kind of getting for you definitely justice knave of swords look at the fine print Look at the fine print where it comes to something being fair to you. Give me some advice. I feel like the advice is just to walk away from this. Advice for Leo on this spread. I feel like it's needed. Ten of Wands in the reverse. Something that you shouldn't get involved with. The Four of Wands. The Ten of Swords in the reverse. If you are... The Three of Wands in the reverse... The King of Cups in the reverse, the Page of Pentacles in the reverse, and the Nine of Swords in the reverse with the Six of Cups. I feel like, again, a strong resounding message of you wanting to invest in something that is going to potentially be a burden or hurt you or not have your best interests at heart. This could be some form of um, emotional manipulation. I feel like this is going to, if you indulge in this, whatever this is, this is going to be throwing your feelings out of whack. This could be that it will leave you in a kind of like a desolate position where you could be giving more than what you're receiving. Um, stay grounded is the advice. Stay grounded. Do not allow any outside influences to kind of throw off your energy. Don't, don't allow any... Um, if, if you're unsure about an individual, um, if it's giving a weird energy... If you are feeling like something is off, listen to that feeling. Do not lead with your um, do not um, lead with your passion, because you may regret that. You may regret that. Magician card. 
and there's something about not allowing somebody to manipulate your emotions as well keep your guard up with somebody until it is right to let your guard down and i feel like whoever this is if this is resonating for you and you feel unsure about a feminine energy that is around you or a masculine take it as it resonates could be same sex as well i didn't even i didn't even um mention that it could be same sex here um if this is this is resonating <coughs> excuse me particularly if you are a masculine dealing with a feminine you need to be careful of emotional manipulation because somebody will will do this they will do it with the queen of swords in the reverse you're dealing with a very nasty character and the advice is to um build your own self up and work on your stability because there's something that you will run the risk of taking a loss if you invest in this person or with this it will be more hassle than what it's worth but i feel like it's more than that i feel like you are running the risk of depleting yourself energetically with money with everything Interesting. <coughs> Sorry, Leo. Still coughing. Right. Let's get you a second spread. <coughs> Ace of Cups in the reverse. Page of Cups. The High Priestess. Six of Pentacles. Somebody could be regretting um, not investing in a connection with you, Leo. You could have somebody who misses you yeah the sun card the six of pentacles this could be somebody who is wanting to invest or give to you give something to you this person you may not be speaking to this person could also be manifesting some sort of communication between the two of you um this person could be spiritual with the moon yeah this could be somebody who you know is spiritual okay could be a pisces or a water sign um somebody could want to apologize for not going all the way with you this is somebody who definitely thinks about this a lot um, again, there's a manifestation of communication or some sort of breaking of silence here. Um, somebody could definitely want to reach you or to bring something into balance here with you. I feel like this person, if, if there was some sort of love lost in a situation or you could feel like you had some sort of unrequited situation, um, I feel like somebody wants to explain why it may have come across that way that something was unrequited. The four of swords it's like somebody could have withheld emotions or acted like they didn't care or didn't love you and they, this person could be going through a healing phase right now this person could be walking away from a lot of things right now that caused a lot of confusion or convolution in a situation to do with you with the four of cups justice yes yeah, somebody wants to make something right nine of cups this is somebody who hasn't given up on some sort of um Ten of yeah, the ten of pentacles, ten of cups, the nine of cups hasn't hasn't given up on some sort of premise that you guys can create something nice for the future. You could have children with this person, page of cups, or this could be somebody who wants children. This could also be somebody who's worried about having children in the future. Like for example, if somebody is of an older age, they could be concerned about not being able to have children like a timing thing like they could feel like they're running out of time this could be somebody who overthinks three of pentacles in the reverse somebody could also feel like they're trying to manifest communication and it isn't working whether this is you or another person switch the role this could all be reverse take it as it resonates scorpio energy if communication has been off between you and a person, I see something very m miraculous happening. Like there's something about the divine stepping in, the tower and the judgment. Yeah, in order for a, yeah, for something to shift forward. 
And this has to do with somebody either not being cooperative with communication or someone trying to manifest some sort of communication out of a situation that is just not working. Scorpio energy or cancer energy. What's the six of pentacles? Yeah, if somebody was holding back from giving you something in the past, this is somebody who wants to spark something back up with you. Hanged man and the five of pentacles. If you felt like somebody was ignoring you or leaving you out in the cold, it's like somebody wants to end that cycle. So why could they not do this in the past? Page of pentacles in the reverse. They didn't have enough to give. The devil. This person could have been consumed by something else. That was kind of oh, okay. This person could have a sex addiction. Okay, well that took a, a, a that that turn quick. <laughs> that took a turn. Crown of Pentacles in the reverse. Page of Pentacles in the reverse. This could be somebody who was using all of their money and resources on some sort of vice. This could have been sleeping around, like they could have been dating whores, you know, throwing their money around with with people or you know, choosing to indulge in some sort of lifestyle that was leaving them broke. So they had nothing to invest with the Wheel of Fortune. But something's changing with that energy. This could be somebody who's walking away from that with the three of wands. It's like somebody's now thinking about the future. I don't know how you feel. How do you feel? Five of Swords. You feel like you need to step into the energy of you're not coming over here with that bull crap with the queen of pentacles you've built yourself some stability you've built yourself something solid and it's like don't come over here with that bs don't come over here with your toxic ass stay over there <laughs> oh leo the knight of swords in the reverse you may reject someone and they may not take it the best with the empress because you've come too far like this is like the energy of Okay, you couldn't get it together in the past, okay? All right, cool. Before wasn't the time. You were investing in whatever addiction, affliction this was, okay? You've left the party. You may feel like you were unwanted by a person. You could feel like somebody didn't really care or love you like that. Something about an unrequited situation. You didn't get the vibe that somebody wanted to be for the cause. Um... And you could have definitely have left this out in the cold. And now you're in the energy of, I'll be damned. I'll be flipping damned. If you come in here with your BS and I'm walking into my, I'm, I'm basking in my nice celebrative energy. I've got over the past with the six of cups. I'm celebrating. I'm partying. I'm enjoying my life. You know, I'm drinking champagne for breakfast. Do you, boo? And, you know, I'll be flipping damned if you come over here with your bull crap and storm my party. The nice, good party. Good, 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 good energy that's going on over here. I'll be flipping damned if you come over here and mess up my crap. That's what you're telling me. Leo, sorry to get all, all, all um, ratchet, ghetto, but I have it in me, trust me. <laughs> Oh my goodness. What will be the outcome? Oh, the tower and the sun. The magician in the reverse. I don't feel like you want this. I feel like you're going to see this as a um, hindrance. Someone trying to throw a wrecking ball, as Miley Cyrus said, into your, your crap. And I get it. Don't come over here and mash up my good, good stuff that I'm here building with your bull crap. You definitely know that person. The judgment, what will be the outcome? You have a decision to make. There you are, Leo. Crown of Wands, the Seven of Swords. You have a decision to make. Yeah, there you are with the Strength card. You've built too much. I'm still getting that energy. Don't come over here with your bull crap. I feel like you've got, you've wised up now. I feel like there's an intelligence about you that maybe you were working on in the past not to say you were stupid in the past but there's something here about you know experiences make us wise you know the stuff that i would have done 10 years ago i'll be damned if i do that stuff today you know there's something like that here what you put up with before you're not about to put up with that again you know especially if somebody's sneaky here you're gonna have a decision to make whether to talk to somebody indulge in a connection how will that go? 
Page of Wands. It will start off small. Four of Pentacles. You may close off to this person. Yeah, because you've wised up. I'll be damned. You know, Knight of Pentacles. I've worked too hard. It's been too painstaking with the um, Knight of Pentacles. I've put in too much consistent work for you to come over here with your Seven of Swords backside. Uh-uh. I feel like you're going to leave it where it's at. You're having a new beginning. You're walking into peace. And that's why somebody's feeling, you know, lackluster. This person could definitely be wanting you to save them. Especially if they've been throwing their money at hoes. You know, throwing their money at whatever sex addiction. Throwing their money at dating people to get a little bit of, you know, backside. Get a little piece of, 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 of the genitalia. Whatever they go for. Knight of Swords. And now they're coming back to you to, for you to save them. After you've done built a nice little something for yourself. Mm -mm. It's, it's, it's not, no. It's, it's a no. This Leo ain't interested. Cross watcher. Leo, I love you dearly. I hope that you enjoyed the reading. If you like how I read, please like, share and subscribe to the channel. But until next time, sending you love and light. I will see you soon. Bye. Love y'all.